Now you will learn step by step how you can make money on Udemy. I have used these steps myself to make money on Udemy and I have seen many many other people using these same steps to make money. So I know that this process works. At the end of this video I will also share with you one ultra powerful secret that some successful Udemy instructors have used to make even hundreds of thousands of dollars on this platform. So watch this video until the end. Let's get started right away with step number one. Go to Udemy come and create an account and you need to create an instructor account because this is a marketplace where people learn skills so there are students and then there are instructors so people who teach things and if you want to make money you need to be an instructor second step is to pick a topic that you want to teach people about and remember you don't need to be perfect to start teaching other people sometimes people have like thinking like i need to be like world class in order to teach somebody let's say that there is a scale from one to 10 and your level is let's say three for example you can still teach those people who are in the level one or two you can teach them some basics how to do things steve why maybe he's in level 10 but he cannot teach so well people who are maybe in one or two you may be even better teacher or let's say programming you don't need to be a world-class programming if you know some basics you can pass them on to some people who are not yet on the level that you are so you don't need to be perfect you don't need to know how to create super successful videos so like something like high quality you can get started wherever you are with whatever you know because oftentimes we underestimate our skills and we think that we need to be some like a world class like you know world champions no that's not required you simply need to be one or two steps ahead of your students so pick something that you know and you are passionate about that you want to teach for other people second advice is that you can use the udemy marketplace insights tool that tool shows you a little bit about the potential uh, like how much money you can earn within certain topics let me give you one example for example i wrote here photography and udemy marketplace the top monthly revenue is like fifteen thousand dollars per month media monthly revenue is only 24 dollars per month that is probably because there are so many courses in this topic as you can see number of courses demand is high and the student demand is also high then it also gives you like top search keywords so this can also give you like ideas if you want to create some other type types courses for example DSL photography or something else and then you can scroll down and it will give you like the idea of the competition like it says what are the top courses within this category and so on and so forth photography for example is super competitive and as you can see some people are earning good money with this then I took another example chess that is not so competitive but on the other hand people who are teaching about chess on Udemy they are not earning so much so you can use this market insights tool to a little bit determine what is the competition and so on and so forth but don't get fixated with that like this gives you some idea but sometimes I've noticed that this is not 100% accurate so you can get some ideas with this but don't get too fixated with it okay once you have finished step two so deciding a topic for your course you move to step number three click create a new course on Udemy and you start creating your new course this is wonderful because Udemy shows you step-by-step -step instructions how to create a course like by filling out the boxes and that is step number four you simply fill out these boxes for example what will students learn in your course are there any course requirements and who are your target students so Udemy tells you what to do it's very like you step by step follow their instructions I was actually surprised when I was creating my first Udemy courses on this marketplace and I was like hey this is easier than I thought because they give you those instructions step number five is to upload your course videos and remember now your videos don't need to be perfect or world class or anything I have seen all types of videos on Udemy they don't don't need to be perfect even courses that are making like lots of money like thousands of dollars or even tens of thousands of dollars for creators they don't need to be like world class if you can teach something to somebody people don't require you to be perfect if you can teach for example let's say you are teaching English they don't like they don't think about so much about the video quality they simply want to learn the words like they simply want to learn the topic so focus on the topic of course quality it can be give you like some extra but don't like don't be too afraid about the quality because I, I tell this because I know a lot of people are so afraid like you can see my U YouTube videos my Udemy videos I make mistakes all the time I still make a living online and you don't need to be perfect to get started then you can of course improve all the time another advice that I would give for you is that follow Udemy 
these guidelines to get approved. They are not super strict, but there are some guidelines. For example, uh, your video quality must be 720 pixels. That is quite like normal, nothing specific, nothing special here. Then there must be some video lessons, so not only text lessons, and you have rights to use content. So of course you cannot steal content from somebody and then use their videos. You need to create something new. So they are very simple, like common sense, but be sure to re read that through at least once so you a little bit understand what are the guidelines. Then step number six, once you have uploaded the videos and everything, fill out the boxes in Udemy, you want to create a course cover and this is so-called thumbnail also. I recommend that you can go to canva.com and you can create this for 100% free. In my experience, usually what works well with the thumbnails is to have some face in the thumbnail. Of course, it depends on the topic, but that's something to know. Also, Udemy doesn't allow you to have letters. So, for example, on YouTube, you can put letters in the thumbnail. On Udemy, you cannot do it, just so you know. Then the step number seven is exciting. You publish the course, you click publish, and then you need to wait, for example, one to six days. It always depends until it gets approved. Somebody from Udemy team, they will approve it. And there is actually something very great. If your course doesn't uh, like fill out all the requirements, they will tell you, they will tell you, hey, simply fix this thing here and then you can fix it and then you can click approve again and then you can move forward. So they give you help, they help you to create your courses in this way. Let's say that now your course is approved, it's ready on the Udemy marketplace. Step number eight is go to Facebook groups and share free coupons on for your course because if you have a new course and there are not any students, the chances are that people are not going to buy it. But you can share these coupons for free so people can enroll into your course, they can take a look at the lessons and then they can leave reviews. And then people, when they find your course in the Udemy marketplace, they will see that, hey, people have been going through this course, here are the reviews, here is what kind of experience people have, and they, people will buy your course, like new people who see your course right there. And my advice is that do this regularly over and over again, so you will get more and more people into your course, and more and more students, and more reviews. I want to mention that some Udemy instructors don't recommend this strategy. Some people recommend it. For example, Jerry Banfield, he made like 1.7 million dollars on Udemy. He said sharing free coupons, this is a great strategy. He recommends it. But then there are some instructions I've seen, they don't recommend it. So you can decide, This, like I use this myself, you can decide if you want to use it or not. Or you can find another strategy. If you have, for example, audience already on YouTube or let's say email list or, or some Facebook social media channel, of course you can promote also there. But promoting through these free coupons and then getting reviews, getting found on Udemy marketplace, this is one strategy. Step number nine, once you start getting reviews, I advise that you reply to all of those reviews at least once a month. For example, say thank you for a good review or let's say thank you for a great review. Next time I want to improve, make it even better. I hope you enjoy it and so on and so forth. Just some simple things so people see that you are engaging. And now we are moving to those secrets that you can use to increase your earnings on Udemy. Step number 10 is send announcement and promotional emails to engage with with your students. So let's say that you created one course and people enroll in that course. Let's say for example 100 people. Then you create another course. How you can start selling this course is to send so-called promotional email to those students who bought your first course and maybe some of them they enjoyed your first course so now they will go and buy the second course. Or let's say that you have this course right here, there are students. Then you add one lesson there, you make the course better. You can send an announcement for your students and you say, hey, I added a new lesson, go and watch this lesson. So you get your students more engaged and that can also increase your reviews and it can get more people to buy your course because it's more comprehensive. So then you just repeat this same process over and over again. You create a new course, you go to Facebook, groups, you promote it there, then you send promotional emails to your students when you launch a new course and you keep on improving your course, you add new lessons, send announcements to your uh, students and then you repeat it, you repeat it, you repeat it. And how much money can you make on Udemy? Well, I would say that the similar principles apply here as with any other business. Like uh, uh, some people fail, like most people actually fail with any kind of business. You have probably heard about those like, I don't know, numbers within five years, 90% of the people fail. I think it's the same with Udemy. But then there are some people who make even millions. So 
the scale is like this like any kind of business but there are some people who are making like really big money with udemy courses however you need to know that on udemy even though you would set the price like 200 dollars per course udemy always has some promotions so they will sell your course for example 10 or 15 dollars and you will get some share of that so you cannot make lots of money for each sale that's why there is this one powerful secret people who have who have been like top instructors who have like the most money on udemy they usually have like 20 courses or 15 courses or 30 courses many courses around the same topic so for example if you want to teach people programming don't just create one huge course like 10 hours rather create some small courses like programming for beginners programming for intermediate programming for advanced or let's say programming python language or programming java c and then you have many different courses and then people can buy many of your courses that's also what i have done as a student and also as an instructor for example there was some guy who created a marketing course then i bought one course i was happy with that i bought another course from him then i bought another so this creator earned money and also i do the same on myself i create courses about making money online all about the same topic so perhaps somebody if they like my course they can buy one course the second course the third course and so on and so forth that's what i also recommend for you create many courses about similar topics don't do this like don't create one course about guitar one course about programming one course about chess and you know about different topics it's better to do with the similar kinds of topics of course like if you have many skills of course you may do this but uh, in order to get the maximum results it's usually better to stay within one topic so then people who enroll in your courses they will buy many courses from you now this was kind of like an overview of this step-by-step -step process how you can make money on udemy if you have any questions about like some specific steps or something ask me in the comments below and perhaps i will create a video where i will answer your questions and give you even more details i will do everything that i humanly can to help you to make money online so make sure that you are also subscribed to this youtube channel learn to make honest money online and click the notification bell so you will never miss out anything when i show you how to make money online 